Gemini Advanced is here, y'all. And now we have the ability to integrate it with our Google Workspace. As of now, it currently only integrates with Gmail, Drive, and Docs. So we're just gonna do a real quick video here, checking it out, see what it does, give an opinion. Welcome back, y'all. In this video, we're gonna be checking out Gemini Advanced when it comes to their integration feature, Google Docs and Gmail. I'm just gonna summarize a real quick fake business plan. We're gonna see how it ciphers through Gmail. This is kind of Google's version or Google competing with Microsoft's Copilot. If you're familiar with Microsoft Copilot, we did a whole playlist on this channel. Basically, that one integrates within the actual software itself. As you'll see, this one up to this point, from my understanding, does it integrate into Google Docs and Gmail specifically, but rather we call upon it within the chat interface, as you'll see in today's video. So let's gonna jump in. Now to access this feature, you can go ahead and click the link down below. It's gonna bring you to this page. You get the first two months free, no charge. And then we get this standardized $20 a month. As we see with a lot of these AI language models, you're gonna be able to start leveraging this right away. Once we're in Gemini Advanced, in order to enable this feature, we're gonna come over here to our settings, click that. We're gonna hit extensions, scroll down here, and then make sure to click that little slide bar here. This is gonna give access to Gemini for everything in your Google Workspace account. One other thing I wanna point out as well is that if you have a business Google Workspace account, it seems like this feature isn't enabled yet. It seems like it's only enabled for personal accounts. That's why you see the name Brownlick as I couldn't use my Web Cafe account in this context. Let's go ahead and gut check it. So I have a doc within my Google Drive here called Business Plan. This is just some fake information about a potential business. It's called Team Sync. So we're gonna gut check this a little bit. I'm gonna go and copy the name here. Come back to Gemini Advance. Not that page, this page. I'm gonna say find my business plan doc and summarize it into a short paragraph about the specific name and value. I don't dispel everything correct. I'm gonna hit enter here. There we go. It's accessing Google Workspace as you see with that nice little user interface. It gives us a associated doc that it looks like we could probably click on. Okay, we can click on it. This is all the information relevant to that document. Come back over to Gemini here. It has found the business plan doc and it is giving us a small paragraph here. This document outlines a business plan for a new company named Innovate Tech, which is developing a project management tool called TeamSync for remote teams. The product is designed to be user-friendly and adaptable. Okay, so it seems like it does know what's what information is in the doc, so we gut checked it. In this use case, you would probably wanna use it to find certain documents within your Google Drive and start summarizing or getting bullet points on information that already exists there. One thing I did notice comparative to Copilot, but I assume will probably be added in the future from Google, is there doesn't seem to be like any type of chat bot that we can add within the actual Google Doc user interface itself. I assume long-term though, They'll probably add that kind of what was we saw with Copilot and Microsoft. Let's try out his Gmail feature here, which seems to be more oriented towards finding emails. We're gonna say find the tube stamp welcome email and give me a one sentence summary. Hit enter here, loading up with Google Workspace, assessing emails. There we go. We got tube stamp welcomes to you through their community, provides instructions on how to get started with their service. We can go and click here. And it will bring us to that email. Solid stuff. I mean, especially if you have really large inbox, like I have a bunch of red messages, that could be very useful when you're trying to cipher through and find a specific email about a very specific context. As a side note as well, Gemini Advance isn't available on Gmail's interface, but I see this as a step in the right direction, being able to access sheets in the future, presentations in the future. We're getting more and more AI abilities within like basically ecosystems we've already used in the past. So we're automatically creating a presentation automatically creating a whole summary in a Google Doc. This is pretty prevalent and pretty obvious that it's coming. So make sure to subscribe if you want to see more videos on those topics. Without further ado, I'll see you in the next video. This playlist right here is going to be a Google Gemini Advanced playlist. There's probably only one video in it right now, but it's going to be in the future, probably a lot more. This is a random video. This my face. Something may or may not happen when you click it. Who knows? I'll see you in the next video.